Everybody, welcome back to another Sci-Fi Block unboxing. This is the Sci-Fi Block for December. Um, yeah, let's get right into it. My lovely wife will hit open the books. <laughs> Apparently that's fun. Apparently it is. All right, my lovely wife will now open the box. I have to open it for you too. Yes. Jeez. Yes. I cut up your meat while I'm at it. I mean, it would help. All right, yeah. let's put this over here. Apparently, we got a lot of exclusives in this box, so. Christmas. I'm already seeing something real cool in here. What is this? A Star Trek Borg puzzle cube. A solution is futile. <laughs> oh, this is actually pretty awesome. We'll open that up in a second. See what we got here. We got some kind of a pin here from Wolf. Sorry, Wax Off Design. I don't know where I got Wolf from. Custom collectible by Wax Off Design. I don't think this is from anything. It looks pretty cool. So I just acquired the best tie ever. Alderon and the Death Star tie. Huh. That is pretty freaking awesome. I'm not gonna lie. All right, that's pretty cool. So far this box has been a bunch of win. What you we just got? need to get, you know, like a nice suit to wear with it. <laughs> yeah. Or you could just wear the tie. Or you could just wear the tie. So we've got something here from Skynet. Neural Net Based Artificial Intelligence. Cyberdyne Systems Corporation, Terminator 2. What could this be? Could you? Open these books up. See if we can get in there. This has been a real, real cool freaking uh, nerd block. Aha, for or a sci fi my block. Collection. For your collection. I thought shot glasses did. Oh, the shot glasses. Yeah. Skynet. <laughs> Skynet shot glasses. That's great. Oh, look at that one. That's even better. That is so cool. 800 on there. Oh, that's pretty bright. Sorry, guys. That is pretty cool. Awesome. Also, this is Starship Troopers. This is Starship Troopers? Really? Yeah. It'd be nice if they said something on there. God, it goes to show you that I should really watch that movie again. <laughs> nice. Oh, did you cheat and look at the card? Yeah. Oh, okay. That was my big reveal for the end of the video. All right, and the last oh, item in here. We got a black box. Just what I always wanted. <laughs> could up a it could literally be anything. What is in this black box? Oh, we need the exacto knife. Oh, it's a black box with styrofoam, styrofoam in it. Woo! Just what I wanted. Thanks, nerd block. It's like Christmas, come early. Best sci-fi block ever. <laughs> okay. Oh, a little Death Star candle holder. Oh, a Death Star candle holder. I don't know how the Flash is going to read this. <laughs> oh, okay. You know, it's not too bad the Flash isn't being too annoying. Look at that. It's like the sci-fi block has gone all classy into it. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty cool. Death Star candle holder. All right. Uh, let's open up this. Or you could probably fill it with m and uh, that, that could be a thing we do. <laughs> that is most likely a thing I would do. Before we reveal the shirt, let's get a closer look at this board cube puzzle thing. Oh, okay, so it's like a, a it's like a Rubik's Cube, but you gotta make the board cube. It's okay. already a board cube. All the sides look exactly the same. <sighs> Spoken like a true Star Wars fan. Yep. <laughs> They do not all look the same. There is an intricate pattern here, and you must match up the pattern, okay? Okay, they're comic book guy. Well, you guys always call me it, so. All right. You, look like a comic book guy. you know what? Let's stop talking about the comic book guy for a second. You got the blue shirt. Okay, I'm can totally we can we the can we reveal the shirt, please? Thank you very much. <laughs> what do we got here? Best shirt ever. <laughs> is that supposed to be the Kraken? I'm assuming twenty thousand links under the sea, but that's different. 
That's a pretty cool shirt. Awesome. All right. Let's see what we got here in the box. Uh, let's see. So we got the shirt here, 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. Okay. So I, I'm assuming you glimpsed that on the on the paper card as well. No, it's because I read books. There's yeah. these magical things yep. made of paper. Here we got the Star Wars. Ancient oh, technology. it's a Star Wars Death Star pencil holder. M&M's. We could do M&M's as well. The Star Wars Alderaan tie, the fleet pin from Starship Troopers, and the shot glasses. And then, oh, the board cube. Alright, let's see what we got coming to us next year. Or next year? Actually, yeah, next year. Okay. I'm right. Okay, let's see. You're accidentally correct. I was accidentally correct. <laughs> Alright, so, in January, sci-fi block is evolving to sci fan block what get a sci-fi fan in a box i don't know if i like that <laughs> i don't want no sci-fi fan or sci fan sci fan so they're changing it to the sci fan block interesting this is dumb let the journey the, begin a strongly worded letter, dear. if they listened i would so this is, okay, so this will now be the ultimate sci-fi and fantasy box. Not just sci-fi anymore. Sci-fan. Oh, okay, that makes there sense. That makes sense, yeah. All right, I guess that's okay. I mean, I got the... I know, but I got the sci-fi block because I like sci-fi more than I like fantasy. I like fantasy more than I like sci-fi. So there. You heard it here, folks. Jeez. All right, let's see what we're getting next year. Yeah, see, I'm already hating this. Okay. A taste of things to come. Harry Potter. whoop de doo Doctor Who. Doctor Who is great, but well, Harry Potter? I don't give a crap about Harry Potter. If this was the sci-fi block still, it wouldn't be Harry Potter. Dungeons and Dragons. Okay, I can live with that. Lord of the Rings. Okay. Next month's sci-fi block. It's five exclusives. Okay. All right. So, yay. Harry Potter is liked by a lot of other people. Just because we don't like Harry Potter doesn't mean it's not known. I understand that, but I wouldn't expect it from a sci-fi block. Mm, that's that's why I got the sci-fi block. I'm unhappy, nerd block. I was happy. This stuff is all cool. This, this hurts me. I think this revelation has tainted my rating of this box. We'll see. Uh, okay, so a lot of cool stuff. I'm a little disappointed on what's to come, but maybe I'm just worrying for nothing. I often am. Usually. Yeah. So, okay. Uh, a lot of cool stuff in this block. Um, hmm. I just want to think of a situation where I can use this tie. Screw that. I want to go to some super awesome important event and wear this. Hopefully other clothes too. Obviously I'll be wearing other clothes. <laughs> I will not be going out in the not nude. Just the thigh. No one wants to see that. <laughs> Alright. Enough playing around. Let's get this thing rated. Um The tie was cool, the pin is awesome now that I know what it is. <laughs> I mean it looked cool to begin with, but yeah, I had no idea what it was. Uh, Borg, Star Trek, yay. I'm a, I actually am a little disappointed there was more Star Wars stuff in here than there was Star Trek. Like, we got three Star Wars items. I was really hoping to, for a bit more Star Trek, but whatever. Oh, we got the, uh... The tie. The tie. Oh, sorry, two Star Wars things. I apologize. There are two Star Wars things. I was hoping for more Star Trek. Regardless... You're always hoping for more Star Trek. Always. Star Trek is the best. It's you didn't the, get the Star Trek. If they had a start, if they had a Star Trek box, I would cancel all my other subscriptions and just stick with Star Trek box. Anyways, I'm gonna give this block a four out of five. Uh, what do you want to rate this? I will give this three ex planet exploding M and M's holders out of five. That's gonna be an interesting thing to Photoshop. Can we go buy some M and M's. <laughs> so you heard it here, folks. My my wife gave her. Yeah, the most interesting way possible uh so that's it for this video um check back real soon for our loot crate video I, I we actually did a loot crate for halloween and uh i haven't uploaded it yet i haven't had time to work on it 
that's gonna be a little late but if you guys are interested that'll be up real soon uh but yeah that's everything guys uh please like the video if you liked it dislike it if you didn't uh please subscribe for more content if you enjoy the video and want to see more apparently subscribers are no longer uh getting notifications whenever their uh youtubers that they're following have uploaded videos and all that stuff and I am a very small YouTuber and I shouldn't be complaining, but I have noticed that some videos have not been getting the views that they used to get. It's either because my stuff has become too boring or because nobody knows when I'm uploading stuff. So if you're a new subscriber or if you're a current subscriber, if you look down at my name, there's a bell right next to it. If you click on that bell and select to receive notifications whenever the YouTuber has uploaded videos, please do so. Um, that way you'll know when I upload stuff and you guys will get to see it and you'll help me out. So that's everything guys, thanks very much. Uh, click on these links here, everywhere, for other past videos and stuff, and uh, we'll see you next time. Also, I, I accept all donations of M&Ms at any and all times. <laughs> and we accept M&Ms. Sorry, my wife accepts M&Ms. I will not eat your M&Ms, I promise. <laughs> all right, see you later guys.